Caught on camera in broad daylight, a bold and brazen car theft. The group of thieves busting out a back window and diving inside that vehicle. The entire theft pulled off in less than 60 seconds. Our Paul Bloom joins us live in Minneapolis tonight. Paul, this is just the latest in a surge of stolen Kias and other vehicles all across the Twin Cities. Randy, frankly, it is out of control. That this Kia you saw in the video there belongs to a 21-year-old woman who just moments earlier was inside that vehicle taking a break from a busy workplace. It was 11 o'clock in the morning, broad daylight, and you saw in that video the thieves just did not seem to care. And within three or four minutes, they're gone. It's unbelievable how fast they can get in and gone. Mike Gustafson is a service advisor at Christian Brothers Automotive in Maple Grove. So he knows cars and knows all about the recent explosion and thefts of Kias and Hyundais, including this Elantra, towed to his shop after a recent recovery. We just want to make sure that it, it stays on the top of the news, if you will, you know, to hopefully bring more awareness, keep the awareness there. Mike has seen the damage done by the thieves with windows knocked out and steering columns wrecked but never had it felt so personal as it did this week. Watch this video obtained by Fox 9 as young thieves in broad daylight, boys and girls shattering the back passenger window, diving right in a Kia Sportage. One even stops for a moment to relieve himself at the trunk. The kids appear to have no care in the world, quickly making off with the SUV. It belongs to Mike's 21-year-old daughter, Sammy. I'm thankful that I wasn't in, in the vehicle at the time because I feel as... A lot more stuff. Something could have gone wrong. I could have gotten hurt. We caught up with Sammy Gustafson on FaceTime Wednesday. She reports the vehicle was parked in a business lot along a busy Minneapolis corridor in the shadows of downtown while she was working. A pattern of thefts that has frustrated law enforcement as well as Kia and Hyundai owners whose vehicles are not equipped with immobilizers, making them easy targets for young thieves. They're not allowed to chase them. They're not getting prosecuted. You know, it's it's very frustrating, very frustrating. And the Gustafsons went on to tell me responding officers pegged members of that crew as just 11 to 14 years old, adding it's believed they were responsible for smashing and taking some 15 vehicles Monday alone. Official MPD data tallied a total of 233 auto thefts last week. Approximately 70% of those reported to be Kia and Hyundai models. The numbers stunning. The Gustafson saying today something has got to give. We're live in downtown Minneapolis tonight. Paul Bloom, Fox 9.